Hi, I'm Meredith, and each week I'm sitting here with you in my living room to share my personal experiences about living and working in a small town. So when we originally purchased the building a few years ago, it was purchased for the intention of the Mighty Children's Museum. And then, you know, that project went really well. We um, also now rented to a coffee shop in the front. Um, so that is done. It looks great. It's been very successful. So through that entire process, the question always was, are you going to do the apartments? Are we going to do the apartments? And I think we always wanted to. It wasn't a question if we wanted to. It was a question of if we could. Because with doing four apartments in an extremely old building downtown that has not been touched in many years comes a lot of money and a lot of time. And, you know, I'm one of six investors. It's a great group to be involved in. We all bring something different to the table, but we all have full-time jobs and we all have families. And so when you take on projects like this, it requires a lot of extra time outside of your job, outside of your family. When you're kind of putting yourself out there and you're committing to doing a project, it, it can create a lot of stress. And, you know, I think one of the biggest factors in deciding if we were going to be able to move forward with this project or not is money. I mean, it was a very costly project. Um, you know, can this be done, you know, for, you know, a reasonable amount of money and it can it be successful and will it be received well by the community? No one else has ever done this as long as I've been around as far as creating nice luxury apartments in our downtown. So, you know, we kind of wanted to take it a step above. We wanted to finish the building in its entirety so that we had a nice property that was fully renovated and finished from top to bottom. Um, there have been a lot of other great people and um, businesses that co have come to our downtown and renovated, but not a lot have really taken it to the next level. And that's what we wanted to do. Um, so when you put the word luxury in front of an apartment, you know, it, it kind of, you get some different reactions. And, you know, we're approaching this from the sense of, we've visited other cities and we know what other urban areas are doing and it's, it's where people want to be. People want to live and work and be in their small community in their downtown. And with that, they want that cool vibe. They want these buildings renovated. They want the exposed brick walls. You know, this is what people want. And we really, we felt very passionate that this could work and that there was a market for this. Um, but like I said, the question was, can we afford it? Um, financially? Can we afford the stress of it? Um, can we all get through this together? So, you know, that, those were the big questions going, you know, leading up to this project. And there was a lot of back and forth and a lot of, there were times where we, you know, there might've been, we're not doing it. And then we are doing it and then we're not doing it. And obviously it came to a point where we decided, yep, we're jumping in and we're doing this and we're going to make a go at it. So throughout this process, we have also experienced some pushback. Um, things haven't always been super easy and positive. We know what our vision is for the apartments and the goal of the community, but not everybody sees that. Um, some people think that, you know, the prices are too high. It can't be supported in our community, that we should have an elevator, um, just different things like that, you know? So having to overcome those objections, because ultimately we know what our goal is. We know that we have a passion for our community. We know if we complete this project, hopefully others will be inspired and it can continue down the line and it will bring more people to our community um, to live and to work. And it will, it will just, it will be better overall for, for everyone involved. And the fact that we have that vision and that passion, we're hoping will transcend into other people um, to do the same thing. So we really believe that completing these four luxury apartments in our downtown will really help to change the perspective of our community and the people that live here. Uh, we want people to understand that this can happen, that people will come, that people want this, um, that they want nicer things, that they want to live in a nice space in their downtown, and that it's just only going to help everybody around you, and it's going to bring more life and revitalization to our community.